Hello, today we're going to work with two-step word problems uh, using addition and subtraction if needed. So first I'm going to read the problem and it says Benny wants 168 cupcakes for his party. Benny has already made 72 cherry cupcakes and 60 berry cupcakes. How many more cupcakes does Benny need to make? Okay, so this is a two-step word problem. The first thing is I read the question. I mean, I read the problem, then I read the question. Question, how many more cupcakes does Benny need to make? So he's done some, we just need to figure out how many more he needs. So if I'm looking at this, um, he has to have a total of 168. He made 72, then he made 60 cupcakes. We're still wanting how many more does he need to get to 168? So that's my question there. All right, so let's, let's look at this. First step, he has 168, but he has already made 72 cupcakes, cherry cupcakes and 60 berry cupcakes. So I could either add these two together. So let me start there. I'm going to add my 72 plus my 60. Um, in here, you can see that this 168 is, is my whole number and these are three parts. So I'm gonna add these three parts and then I'm gonna subtract. So I have two and then seven plus six is 13 then I'm going to subtract 132 from this 60 168 to find out how many he has left that's uh, 6 and 3 and so there it is he needs 36 can I show it with a picture yeah I certainly can let me let me show you the picture so I'm subtracting, right? Basically, I can subtract this, subtract that, and whatever is left is what I have. So I'm going to do 168. So there's my 168. So I'm going to subtract. Uh, first, let me subtract. 72, I'll do two ones and I'll do seven tenths. Well, I don't have enough for seven tenths because I only have six here. So I'm going to have to use this and move it over here. And now I can subtract seven. So, so this is four, eight, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven making sure that I have seven, I have seven. Okay, so I've done this 72. Now I have to do 60. Well, I don't have to take any ones yet, so I have to take six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so I'm left with one, two, three here, and I'm left with two, four, six here. Okay, so notice how I got the same thing, 36 here and 36 here. So that's a way to verify that. So my answer would be, basically, like I said, you can do it in different ways. You can add 60, that give you 132, and then subtract 132 from 168, which gives you 36. That's your answer there. Let's work on the next one. The next one says, uh, Mike likes to collect coins. Mike got 22 coins from his brother, 28 coins from his mother, as well as 19 coins from Sandy. However, Mike lost 29 coins before putting those coins into his piggy bank. How many coins does Mike have? So my question is, how many coins does Mike have? Well, here are some of the words that I'm looking at, okay? He likes to collect coins. It doesn't tell you how much coins he has, 
okay we don't we don't know how much coins he has but we do know that he got 22 from his brother he got 28 from his his uh, mother and then he got 19 from Sandy however um, however from this whole thing we don't know how much he has he lost he lost uh, 29 so that's I'm gonna subtract 29 so notice the word got means add uh, and 28 from and then it continues right so the word God is your verb and as well as 29 so I'm making sure of all my this word here lost means that he's a, you're 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 gonna take away so we're as we're for trying to find it out how many he has okay so so what can I do well I can add these three to find my total because I don't know how much all this is and then I can subtract to find how many he has left okay so that's what I'm gonna do I'm going to uh, add 22 28 20 oh 19 right there and it's okay to make mistakes just catch your mistakes right so I'm looking for my strategies here uh, mental strategies can I make a 10 yep I see a 10 right here and then plus 9 that's 19 I can do it in my mind 19 carry my 1 so this is 2 and 2 that's the double right there so that's 4 5 and 6 okay now from here I'm going to have to subtract this 29 that I lost that uh, he lost that Mike lost so it's 9 minus 1 is 0 6 minus 2 is 4 so my answer is 40 can I show it in a in, in a picture form yeah I can but I'm gonna have to erase all this so it's uh, 22 28 19 the answer is 69 and then 69 minus 29 equals 40 all right so I need the space here so I'm going to erase this because I'm gonna have to draw everything that Mike received so here's my tens my ones and my tens so first I'm gonna draw 22 then I'm gonna draw 28 because that's what he received then I'm gonna draw 19 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 okay so that's my three numbers and then I'm gonna have to subtract the not the 29 that he lost first I'm gonna go with my ones so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 nine and he's left with one two three four five six seven eight nine ten hmm ten that is weird well I cannot have if I if I write ten can I write ten here no I can't I can't have this ten right here so basically this 10 has to go over here now that I have my 10 over here I have to go I have to subtract 2 1 2 and I'm left with 4 there we go so there that's my answer I just got a little off there because I've had to I can't have two on my, a, a group of 10 on my ones I have to push it to my tens but look, the answer came out correctly. Hope you uh, learned something today. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.